Hey everybody, welcome to Music City Storytime. I hope that you're having a great day today. Well, we're still in our Disney My First Cuddle Bedtime Storybook. So let's get started and see what this next story is. Dumbo Snowy Day. Aww. One chilly day, the circus animals were on their way to a new town. Their train was struggling to get through the falling snow. The train came to a stop, and everyone waited for the snow to pass. Dumbo was happy. He'd never played in the snow. Mrs. Jumbo gave him a gentle nuzzle. Soon, Dumbo got the hang of walking through the snow. All morning, Dumbo and his mother played in the snow. Suddenly, Dumbo slid down a steep hill ending in a cliff. When Miss Jumbo reached the bottom of the hill, she realized she couldn't get back up. You will have to fly off and get help, Mrs. Jumbo said. So off Dumbo flew as fast as his ears would take him. Dumbo raced to the train. Quickly he gathered all the animals together so they could help. What are we waiting for? Timothy Q. Mouse cried. We've got to save Miss Jumbo. Dumbo led his friends back to the cliff. By the time they found Mrs. Jumbo, the windstorm had pushed her even closer to the cliff's edge. The animals knew they had to think of something fast. Oh dear, said the giraffe. How can we get down there to help? Hmm. Timothy snapped his fingers. He had an idea. Everybody line up, he shouted. He ordered the animals to grab one another's tails. At the front of the line, the ostrich leaned over the cliff to take hold of Mrs. Jumbo's trunk. One, two, three... Pull, Timothy yelled. The animals worked together until Mrs. Jumbo made it safely to the top of the cliff. But suddenly, there was a loud crack. The cliff side started to give way. All the animals tumbled together and rolled down the hill. Before long, they had become a giant snowball. How do you stop this thing, Timothy shouted. The snowball gathered speed until... Oh, that's going fast. <laughs> the animal snowball hit the bottom of the hill and broke apart. Is everyone okay, Timothy asked. Fortunately, everyone was fine. Just a little dizzy from their unexpected snow ride. All the animals began walking back to the train. That night, Mrs. Jumbo gave Dumbo a warm bath. Thank you for flying to find help today, Mrs. Jumbo said. Hey, don't forget about me, said Timothy from his teacup bath. I helped too. Look at there, little Timothy. <laughs> Mrs. Jumbo nodded. You certainly did. Thank you. <laughs> then it was time for bed. Dumbo snuggled up against his mother, and Timothy nestled underneath Dumbo's ear. Dumbo fell asleep right away. He was glad to be warm and safe with his mother as the snow fell gently aside. Oh, I love that story. I like Dumbo, too. Well, I hope you've enjoyed it. And listen, always remember, you are special. Until next time.